Hello everyone, uh, welcome to my channel. And this video is about the respiratory pigments in different phylogenetic groups. So respiratory pigments are the pigments uh, which is made up of the protein and the metallic ion and which combines with the oxygen and decrease the amount of the free molecules. Such protein gives a particular color called as the respiratory pigment. So there are various types of the respiratory pigments present in different organisms like hemocyanin, erythrocyanin, chlorocyanin, hemoerythrin and the hemoglobin. So hemocyanins uh, are the copper containing pigments uh, which uh, combine with the oxygen serve as transport pigment and is always found in the dissol dissolved condition in the plasma and occurs in two forms that is oxidized and the reduced form. So next one is the erythrocryonine. It is a giant uh, free floating blood protein contains iron metals. Chlorocryonine is also an iron containing pigment and it is similar to the hemoglobin except one vinyl group is replaced by the formyl group. So it, is, uh, it has less oxygen carrying capacity as compared to the hemoglobin. Hemoerythrin is iron containing found in the blood capsules uh, of some invertebrates. It helps in oxygen storage and no porphyrin pigments is present. So myoglobin, these pigments are attached to the muscle. It has same structure as hemoglobin but has only one unit. Uh, hemoglobin contains four units. So its molecular weight is about 17,000 and contains single polypeptide chain with 153 amino acid. So skeletal muscles of the diving mammals is practically rich in the myoglobin which serve as an oxygen storage for the oxygen and dry during a dive. It has same structure as hemoglobin and, and but has only one unit. So next one is the pinna hemoglobin found in the pinna escomosa animals and it is a con manganese containing pigment. Vanglobin is a green color vanadium found in the venerocyte of the sea squirts also known as sadians are present of the venerio vanadium chromagens and it is light color. Echinochrome uh, is a red pigment present in kinase sea urchin echinoderms. So hemoglobin. Hemoglobin is a universal pigment containing iron and found in plasma also. It is both extracellular as well as the intracellular. It is more efficient as molecular weight 68,000 prox. So hemoglobin is a conjugated protein made up of simple protein globin protein which consists of about 96% and the prosthetic group which contains iron metal heme that is 4%. The globin molecules consist of two dimers alpha 1 beta 1 and the alpha 2 beta 2 and it is of which slightly attached group two dimers loosely connect to each other by a salt bridge weak bond present and except that the two beta chain doesn't uh, touch with each other. So Porphyrin lays a porphyrin green of the heme forming a coordinate link with 4 pyrrole nitrogen. So when hemoglobin come in contact with certain chemical like the nitrate or chlorate, the Fe plus 2 changes to Fe plus 3 called a methemoglobin and which uh, with the help of the methemoglobin reductase, methemoglobin is dissociated into the hemoglobin. So structure of the two dimers alpha 1 and beta 1. So I'll, here is the alpha 1 beta 2 uh, be alpha 1 and the alpha 2 is uh, attached with the salt linkage while the beta 1 and beta 2 do not touch with each other. So uh, steatine side chain uh, the hyper uh, here is a hyperbolic curve of the myoglobin. So in lamprey myoglobin one molecule uh, molecule of the oxygen binds with the hemoglobin and the sigmoid curve in the human and so four molecules of the oxygen bind with the hemoglobin. So sigmoid curve and here is a hyperbolic curve. So uh, figure is the oxygen binding curve of the myoglobin and the hemoglobin in comparison between them. So structure of the heme structure the Hb plus O2 forms the HbO2 at low pressure and in it uh, again uh, dissociate into Hb plus O2. So porphyrin ring plus ferrous ion forms the hemoglobin and color of hemoglobin in oxygenated forms uh, gives a scarlet red color while in the oxygenated form it gives a bluish red color. So four pyrrole ring joined by a methylene bridge are named as the porphyrin. So function of the respiratory pigment, the absence of the nucleus in the RBC in mammals allows more hemoglobin to be connect, contained within the cells and allowing more oxygen or CO to be transported uh, around bone's body. So if a carbon monoxide binds with the hemoglobin, that it is irreversible process. And in this way, it slowly binds with all the hemoglobin and actually decreases in body causing death of a person. So avoiding these uh, carbon monoxide gas to inhale. There is a term Bunsen solubility coefficient of the oxygen which is in blood at 37 degrees centigrade 2.4 milliliter of the oxygen per 100 ml of the blood per atmospheric of the oxygen pressure define the burn solubility coefficient of the oxygen. So all about the respiratory pigments in different phylogenetic groups. Keep watching. Thank you.